Hi, my name is Chandra Taylor and I'm a staff attorney at the Chapel Hill, North Carolina office of the Southern Environmental Law Center. I'm here today to speak with you about coal combustion waste. As you may have heard, on December 22, 2008, a massive coal waste spill occurred in Roan County, Tennessee. A surface impoundment at the Kingston plant of Tennessee Valley Authority broke its dikes, flooding acres of land, sweeping homes off their foundation, and displacing families. In addition, the waste entered the Clinch River, causing a massive fish kill. This disaster in Tennessee has brought coal waste to the attention of the American public. What is coal waste? Coal waste results from the burning of coal to produce power. Coal waste contains many heavy metals and pollutants, including arsenic, lead, and boron. These are all known to be toxic to human health and animal health in minute quantities. Despite known risk to human health and the environment, the EPA has failed to set nationally applicable regulations for coal combustion waste. EPA knows that unlined waste ponds pose a cancer risk greater than 900 times above what the government considers acceptable. Even before the spill in Tennessee, Southern Environmental Law Center called on the EPA to promulgate national regulations to protect human health and the environment from coal combustion waste. This massive disaster has shown again that there is no such thing as cheap or clean coal. While it may be cheaper to store the waste in wet surface ponds, these costs are passed along to consumers through greater risk to human health and the environment. This is a matter of great concern to Southern Environmental Law Center because as you can see on this map, there are over 46 unlined coal waste disposal units in our six state region. Because of lax federal regulation, what we have now in the South is an inconsistent and ineffective patchwork of state regulation. The states must do at least as much as the federal government does. For that reason, the EPA should promulgate national safeguards for the disposal of coal combustion waste. The Southern Environmental Law Center advocates a complete phase out of wet surface impoundments. Even with state-of-the-art liners, these type of facilities leave communities facing long-term hazards to human health and the environment and burdens to ensure that the liners and the facility never fail. These risks can be avoided by placing coal waste in dry, composite-lined, and monitored landfills outside of floodplains. This work is part of our region-wide program to reduce pollution from coal-fired power plants, to ensure healthy air and water, and to slow global warming. Thank you so much for your interest and support. Please check our website often for the latest updates.